Hi, Shipmates. I'm Robert John Kirby, the Chief of Information. And I wanted to just talk to you for a few minutes about this thing called the Enhanced Carrier Presence Plan. You may have seen the CNO talk about this in his budget hearings, and you may have seen an article in the Navy Times uh, this week about it. Uh, this plan is going to do a couple of things for us. It's going to allow us to deploy you, train you, in a much more predictable fashion. So you'll do two shorter deployments of seven months each during the course of a training cycle. Uh, so you'll be at sea a little bit longer than you are now, but it'll be on a much more predictable, stable schedule. It's also going to allow us to provide better training and maintenance availabilities for the ships in a carrier strike group over the course of that cycle. The way it's been working now is uh, the deployments are advertised as seven or eight months, and then sometimes they go a little bit longer due to surge requirements overseas. Well, if we can do this plan effectively, and we don't think we're going to get there till probably fiscal year 15, the funding is still being worked out, but if, when we can do this effectively, it will allow us to surge essentially from the scene. In other words, rather than having to surge carrier strike groups from uh, home port, by having a, a larger global carrier presence uh, overall, we'll be able to surge more from the scene, and it will allow us to be a little bit more responsive than we are when we're on deployment. When you're not on deployment, your, your cycle, your training, your maintenance cycle at home will be much more predictable and much more stable. There's a lot more to come out on this. Again, a lot of things still have to be worked out, including the funding for it. Uh, but this is a plan that we believe is going to give the Navy a far greater ability uh, to respond to combatant commander requirements over there uh, while giving you and your families much more stability back here at home. More on it to follow. Thanks very much.